Get Sports Focus is presented by Dr. Ting, sports medicine and orthopedic surgery. Kaylee Chris here with Stanford QB Keller. Chris Keller, we're 20 days out, so tell me how you guys are prepared. Uh, you know, I think we're all excited. We've brought a lot of juice to every single practice so far. Um, right now, it's just a question we can sustain that throughout the whole entire camp, and uh, I think we will. Um, I think we got, got, got a lot of new things going on. Um, but I think we're really excited for the season, our first game. Now, you're a local kid just from across the street, Pally High School. So tell me how Pally prepared you to be here at Stanford. <clears throat> well, uh, over there with Coach Hanson, we uh, ran the West Coast offense, pro style offense. So that really helped me coming into this similar offense uh, with Coach Shaw. And then uh, just being around the area, knowing what it's like around here really helped me get a little adjusted a little better. Yeah. Now, you're from all over the country, kind of. So why did you pick Stanford and why did you stay in this area? Um, I think I've always really liked the school. My mom always liked it. Um, and then once Andrew Luck came here, I always followed him. And uh, my dad worked with Coach Harbaugh, so liked it when he came here. I've always watched Stanford. So I've liked Stanford and watched them for a few years before I even the recruiting process even started. So um, it was always on my radar early. Now tell me what makes Pally special because I mean there's you, there's Kevin Anderson and a lot of D1 players from that school so what makes it so special? Um, I think it's just the area you're surrounded with. Uh, I mean Bay Area is much, I mean San Francisco, San Jose, Oakland. It's a big area, um, it's a good school, traditional football you know and Coach Hanson's been there for a while so he has a, he has a, good, he has a good program going on there even with Coach Alice there now and um, I, think, I think they'll be good. Now, did you and Kevin ever get to play together? Uh, we never did, so I transferred at the end of my freshman year. So we went to school together, but he already finished the season before I got there. But now that you guys are here together, is there any sort of connection because you're both Pally kids? Yeah, yeah, there definitely is. Uh, everyone always makes the Pally jokes and uh, the local guy and whatever, but it's fun being around him. We, ha we have sort of a connection, and uh, we'll, we'll, have some, we'll know things about the area that no one else will know, so it's fun like that. Now, this season is you're going to be your second year here with Stanford. So tell me about your first year at Stanford. Uh, first year was good, redshirted. Didn't have a chance to run the offense as much. You know, I ran scout team. So uh, now I'm starting to really run our offense, get a lot of reps that way. And I think I'm coming along, um, coming along. Still got ways to go, but uh, I'm excited for what has to come. Now, how tight are you and Kevin Hogan? Uh, we're pretty cool. I mean, there's no, no tension or anything between us. He's, he's a great guy. and. Um, yeah, no touch or anything. Take you under his wing at all? Show you the road? Yeah, yeah, he definitely, I'll ask him any questions. Uh, anything I anything I need to be asked, uh, he's more than welcome to help me out, and he's a good guy. Now this is his last season, so will you be ready to take over that starting position next year? Yeah, uh, that's the goal for me right now um, in the long run, but you know, I'm just taking every day, one day at a time, and being the best I can be on the field. All right, well, guys, you heard it here first. He's going to be ready next season. So, all right, good luck this year. We're looking forward to right. watching you play. Thank you.